the Philippines' relationship with China get better under a new government? In a press conference Sunday, the Philippines' president-elect Rudy Duterte says he wants to hold direct talks with the Asian giant. Relations between the two countries soured through President Benigno Aquino's term over conflicting claims to parts of the South China Sea, one of the world's most strategic waterways. Aquino refused to hold direct talks with China. But Duterte says, quote, if the ship of negotiation is in still waters and there's no wind to push the sail, I might just decide to talk bilaterally with China. The Aquino administration earlier responded to China's reclamation activities by signing a defense pact with the United States and filing a legal case with the United Nations Tribunal over the validity of China's claims. The president-elect also says he would restore the death penalty, vowing to give shoot-to-kill orders against criminals who resist arrest. He's also considering combat veteran Army Lieutenant General Ricardo Visaya and sacked police commander Ronald De La Rosa to head the military and police. De La Rosa was relieved from his post after declaring support for Duterte on Facebook. Mm-hmm.